Hello and welcome to the Watchmen on the Wall channel. This prophetic word comes from channel listener Sabrina Bass, Butner, North Carolina. Showtime. I declare and I decree, it is by the power of the blood of Jesus Christ, the authority given unto me through Christ, it is showtime. We take this final stand as we watch now as the Lord does just what he said. The glory of the Lord is falling. To the warring soldiers who have prayed for revival and justice and swift reversals, the rain is falling. Your requests are made manifest. The things that God has told you and inclined you to stand for are not just because. The prayers that you have tried to let go of but won't let go of you, they're being granted. The things that have been worse than ever previously, they have met their expiration date. Glory to God, feel the wind of the Lord's words today. Yes, I know year after year you have waited. You've waited for the same thing over and over. I understand this personally. The heart sickness of waiting. It's been a heavy burden that words could never express. You get your hopes up and then it doesn't happen. You get your hopes up again and it doesn't happen. But I declare to you, this is a new day. God is moving now and he is moving quickly. He is rewarding your long, persevering faith. He will not allow the same thing to remain in your heart if he wasn't going to do it. He would not allow his people that genuinely seek him to keep a godly desire in their hearts if he was not going to fulfill it. If you know that you came to him and continued to come to him with a godly desire in your heart, you can rest in him. If it was a desire that did not come from him for you, he would have removed it by now. If you have continued to seek him, serve him, and have faithfully given yourself with a pure heart, he would not have allowed you to continue to be deceived. Again, he would have removed that desire. He promised us that if we seek him with all of our heart, that we would find him. You've sought him. You've found him. He come, here comes your reward. Let there be no confusion for who this word is for. It is for the faithful people that believe that he is the source, that he is the way. Be confident of your relationship with the Lord. As I heard my pastor say a few Sundays ago, believe that he loves you, that he will move heaven and earth for you. You've believed and served and loved the Lord too long to not see him move for you. This is not stated as an entitled spirit, but this is said in the spirit of assurance of who he is. Also know this, to the ones that are praying for a family member, God gave you knowledge and a glimpse that he has a calling on their life. I declare unto you, your family is coming back to God. They will be a minister. They will be a teacher of his word. They will prophesy. They will lead with holy fear. They will acknowledge him as their Lord and Savior. The Lord is actively dealing with runners right now. <laughs> Not later. He's, he's doing it now because the grace of has been removed and he is shaking up their lives and he is getting down to business. They have been running from and avoiding walking through the door of decision, but the Lord is saying it ends now. This is their choose ye this day moment that you've been praying for. Let the words of my mouth, let the meditations of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. Holy Spirit, come forth in power, conviction and demonstration. So as it is in heaven, so it shall be in earth in the mighty and matchless name of Jesus Christ who gave his life. May every principality and power bow to the name of our Lord and Savior. And may no evil power or work hinder his word on this day. It shall be just as the Lord said. And today, today, wicked one, come out of the runner. Your legal rights are destroyed. You shall never return to the vessel of the Lord. It is finished. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.